I'm here with Maestro John Cho again, and he's going to demonstrate the very end of Coiser Etude Number Four. Now we talk about our main propellers in Uppo Staccato being our first and third finger. Can you show us like this kind of come here motion with your first and third, just your first and third finger, so you can relax two and four. Okay. Great, great. You got your mom doing it over there too. All right, she's gonna have a bow staccato here. Let's let's try it this way. It's like little baby jellyfish, ready? Down bow. Great, can you try that on the caprice, or the etude? making beautiful little circles with his with his those two little fingers great now try to have that feeling with two and four on the bow but you're still going to have one and three be the main source of um, propulsion great great because we always want pinky on the bow or else i bite it off can you try to <laughs> That's the small muscle involved in, in Uppo Staccato. Set your violin down, we're gonna try another exercise. Okay, this is the, our, my puppeteer exercise. So I'm gonna have you do it first. Can you do some Uppo Staccatos with our little hair tie here? Okay, just make me do a down bow, and then four Uppos. Now six. Now eight. Six, seven, eight, down. Great. Okay, let's try it with the bow on an A string. Go ahead and give me down. Try that just on a put a D on the A string, third finger. Try to feel that. Great, all right. So that's a way to keep it loose, kind of that almost vibration of the wrists, all right? Little wrist circles. All right, now can you try it again? I want you to combine the propulsions you had in the first and third finger and the looseness and the wrist pop that you're getting with uh, this puppeteer exercise. Let's try it from da 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 Thank you very much, John. I'm here with uh, Anthony Garino. We're working on the middle section from Caprice number 21 for Uppo Staccato. There are two ways, there's a couple ways we can think about Uppo Staccato. I want you to try for a minute doing just on a, an open A string, some tremolo. Try Uppo. Good, now I want you to do the same thing except going up. Now, I want you to take out the demos. Good. Good. Try not to stiffen your whole body. Very 
good. Now think about making, can you do this for me? Just making a little circle with your arm. A little like you're digging, like tossing a salad or something. That's the motion I want you to think about as you do this. Can you try that? Good, so you can go a little quicker. Good, all right, now think of that motion and try this again. Good, all right, so we can think of a lot, a lot of different pivots. We can have, you know, a pivoting across this muscle, pivoting across this muscle, you know, our whole arm as a joint, all right? So you think about your uh, elbow staccato in this way, and it's gonna get you nice articulation. All right, thanks, Anthony. Thank you.